Hi again, everyone. I'm Mike Lucas for UWBadgers.com with Tuesday's practice report. Over the last four decades, I've seen a lot of players come through here. And whether it's been four or five years, they've all said the same thing in the end. The key to a senior day is managing the emotion. I don't really know what to expect right now. I mean, I'd like to say that I'm not, I'm not going to, you know, break down or cry or whatever. It might get emotional. Um, but realistically, I think I probably will. Um, I, guys say that they don't really notice it to, or know what to expect until you get out there. So I'm just going to take it in and, and just enjoy the moment uh, with my family out there and just um, go out and try to win a ball game ultimately. Kind of a slew of emotions. Uh, probably, you know, obviously it's a happy moment. Um, you know, obviously sad to, to leave the, be leaving the university, be playing in my last home game. But, um, you know, still, still got a few games left and, um, you know, just got to go out there and enjoy it. For wide receiver Nick Toon, it will be a special day because his father, Al Toon, will be the honorary captain. My dad has, you know, been always been a father first to me, and um, you know, obviously a supporter to me um, when, when it came to to athletics. But um, you know, he, he's he's been a, a great influence and, and a great role model to try to follow um, in, during my time here. For fullback Brady Ewing, it will be a special day because of the journey he's gone from walk-on to senior captain. It's pretty amazing um, to come in as a walk-on, uh, not really knowing what to expect, um, just kind of starting on special teams, working up and just kind of just being a part of some great teams and, and meeting some great guys and just being a part of this program has been very special to me. And then uh, coming to now to be able to be a contributor to help us win ball games and, and to be a leader of this team is very, very near and dear to my heart and, and something I don't take lightly and um, just just want to continue, continue it forward. This senior class has a chance to win 10 or more games for a third consecutive season, a school record. Ten years from now, when we look back on this group, what will be their legacy? Just this group of guys, a great group of guys, a bunch of great leaders, um, guys that have played a lot of football, won a lot of games. Um, so be a, to be a part of that is very special. Um, and I think what's most important right now is to carry that forward into Saturday, get a win, and then go from there and, and see where we can end up. But um, that all starts with Penn State. If we can uh, you know, get this, this win this weekend and uh, obviously um, you know, continue to, to, to do positive things here throughout the season, you know, we'll... We'll leave here as um, you know, all-time uh, most most winningest class. So, um, you know that's that's a, a cool opportunity to have, and um, you know hopefully you know we're able to go out there and, and take care of business and make that happen. The Badgers are one step away from Indy and the Big Ten championship game. What will it take to complete this segment of their journey? No, I mean every, everyone knows what's at stake, and um, if you're not ready to play on Saturday, um, you know shouldn't be out there. Uh, but. You know, no one's perfect, but you know, you just got to come out there with the energy and, um, you know, prepare during the week. Um, you know, they, they say you win the game during the week, and you know, you just got to come out every day here um, this week and, and work and, uh, you know, accomplish that. I think everyone knows what's at stake, um, but what's cool about this team is I don't. No one's really talking about what's ahead. Uh, people know what what can come about and that we need to win this weekend, obviously, just like any other game. But um, nobody really talks about it right now. It's Penn State. It's it's senior day and it's, it's the next game on our schedule and I think guys are pumped for that and, and know that with that comes, you know, something further. That's Tuesday's practice report. Join us on Wednesday for a look at the defense. Thanks for watching UWBadgers.com.